You three had a good time last night. Crowd or no crowd, those two only have one speed. Pain. Still can't pretend I'm not a little jealous. Although, I did kind of like watching. Oh? I had to prove a point after their cosplay comment. But if you're into it... Point is, I reckon the four of us together would make for a formidable faction. Not four, but maybe three. Who are you thinking? Zoe's tough, but Shayna's got experience and something you can't teach. The choice is obvious. Why don't I try fighting on her side this time? And you can watch and tell me what you think. Shayna? How do you think Zoe's gonna take the news? Well, let's find out. They're here! The following is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, the captain and Shayna Baszler. Cap is proving herself to be one of the most brutal superstars in WWE history. Is anyone going to stand up to this bully? Not if they know what's good for him, Saxton. Do you want to make her mad? I sure don't. A lesson in brutality is about to be taught. This has all the makings of an all-time classic match, and I fully expect it to deliver on that promise. seem to be adding a potent weapon into the mix in the form of Shayna Baszler as they take on Sonya Deville and Chelsea Green. Which means the question on everyone's mind is, where is Zoe Stark? I'd say the question on Sonya and Chelsea's mind is, am I going to be able to walk out of here tonight? Ooh. Hoist it up. Oh, targeting the stomach. Double leg drop. Into 
to the corner. This can't be good. She's dazed on the top turn. What more can these two superstars do to each other? Whatever it takes. Looking for the fast lane to the pay window. She's looking for something under the ring to even her odds here. That move on its own will knock the wind out of you, but from that height, it'll knock the earth and fire out of you, too. Looking bad for her here. Gut buster! Sonya's lost any momentum here. Sonya keeps getting cut down. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Ooh, a gut buster! That was all sorts of nasty. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Great height. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. There's a snapmare. And a basement drop kick. Going for the x -plex. man. A determined sequence of attacks from her here. Really taking control here. Sonya Deville with the reversal. Sonya managing to get some control back now. She's showing it's not a time to lie down. It's a time to fight back. <laughs> Using the momentum to sweep the leg. She sent back in under the ropes. Would you look at this? She is removing the turnbuckle pad now. Kick to the gut. Ouch. Oh, sit out. Jawbreaker. Eating through a straw for a week. Sonya's lost any momentum here. Deville needs to be resourceful in this situation. Could be a good chance for her to get some distance. Series of elbows looking to create separation. She does so. And she's stunned in the corner. Up on the turnbuckle now. Perched up top. Could be looking for a superplex. Maybe something more. Oh, this is going to be big. This is going to hurt. Avalanche Falcon Arrow. A move from that height could rearrange your bones. We're undoubtedly nearing the end. Yeah, this is it. Well, check that out. Oh, a corkscrew neckbreaker. And the line for Sonya. Will it be? Two great superstars that go great together, and that win is proof. Chemistry on point. Teamwork looking sharp. For my money, this is the best women's tag team around. That went about as well as expected, at least for us. What do you think? Should we make this faction official? Not yet. And not with Shayna. Were you at the same match? Because the two of you sure did a number on those two sacrificial lambs. Trust me. You're the boss. So, back to a duo or back to square one? Neither. I'll take care of it.
Well, this is an unexpected trio. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, the captain, Rhea Ripley and Zoe Stark. Last week, Cap teamed with Shayna Baszler. Now it's Zoe Stark. Where's the loyalty? Loyalty? It's not about loyalty, Saxton. It's about victory. Cap knows you have to use the right tool for the job, and that's exactly what her partner is. Standing together, Cap, Rhea, and Zoe look like a one-way trip to the local medical facility. competitors has incredible singles potential but as a group they may just be unstoppable Last week, Cap and Rhea were with Shayna Baszler. This week, Zoe Stark. This isn't a faction. It's a chameleon coalition. You wonder how comfortable Zoe will be knowing how quickly Cap and Rhea could switch things up again. Zoe's a pro. She'll go out and let the chips and opponent will cover. But back to Ripley. Surprisingly quick kick out. She shows that she's far from finished. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Why 
not look like a million bucks. And she goes for the pin. But now we see Stark. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Not getting the two at this point has got to say something. Standing moonsault gets all of it. Countered it just in time. Oh, check that out. Oh, that close screw neck breaker. This looks bad for Ty. Oh, what a boot to the face. This match is falling apart for her. Yeah, she's looking drained. I don't know how much is even left in her. Hoping to end it here. This is it. She gets the shoulder up. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. If they're sticking together, this is going to spell trouble for every other woman on this roster. It's Shayna Baszler. It looks like someone still has a bit of FOMO. I'd be happy to MO on this, Corey. One thing's for sure, if Zoe Stark was expecting backup from her newly formed faction, she's not getting it. The cat's letting her teammates sink or swim, Cole. It's tough love. Look who it is. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, the captain and Rhea Ripley. Just look at her. Cap doesn't walk. She kicks the earth like it owes her money. She's a role model. She's a force of brutality and intimidation who stabs her friends in the back, Corey. Competition here. You can see exactly why the WWE Universe is so amped up for this one. One time out short-term enemies and now four women looking to settle some scores here on Raw. Honestly, it's been hard to keep track of, but I do know that hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. Except tonight, we've got two. This submission match is going to be spicy. Going for It up. Man, what a gut buster. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Well, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a way to flaunt your abilities. Baszler needs to head this attack off of the pass. Tough night so far for Shayna Baszler. Ooh, and a shot to the body and another. Slam. 
Oh, the heel hook. Stretch. Stops Baszler's attack right there. Oh, I think we're going to see it. Here it comes. x -plus. Got the tag. Got the tag. Bang. Vicious boot. And Rhea finds a counter. Quick thinking pays off. She returns the favor there. Sleeper slam! There's return fire on Rhea. Series of elbows looking to create separation. She does so. A big kick to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Ripley uncorking a clothesline and another ripcord position. Ripcord drop kick. Ripcord. Oh my goodness, nasty line. Places her right in the corner. High risk area up there. You know what, guys? I was afraid it was going to get to this point. Top rope! Stiff shove that creates separation. Maybe get something else going. A big kick to the gut and a thunderous forearm to follow. Ripley unloading on her opponent, and Ripley is in complete control. Yes. In the electric chair, can they somehow counter? Right hands will do it. Uh-oh, disrupts the attack with an elbow straight to the mouth. And that definitely made solid impact. She's up on that top turnbuckle. She won't be for... Up on the top rope. Now to this part of town for these two competitors. This could go south in a hurry. Here we go. Superplex. That wasn't just a move. That was a statement. Tagging her partner in. She's able to make it. Oh, foot meet face. To the gut. Oh, and corkscrew neck breaker. Bad spot for the Queen of Spades. Gets out of it with a well placed knee to the face.
Each of these women could contend for a title alone, but together, they may never lose a match. you can dish out punishment like nobody's business, but you know what would be downright scary and totally mind-blowing? Imagine if you also showed the world that you're just as tough as nails and can take it too! That's the kind of stuff that would leave everyone's jaw on the floor. Oh my god, you should totally have a last woman standing match against Ivy Nile! It's Cap here to unleash her wrath upon the ring. The following contest is a last woman standing match. Making her way to the ring from Laredo, Texas, the Captain. Cap has proven herself to be one of the most brutal superstars in WWE history. Is anyone going to stand up to this bully? Not if they know what's good for him, Saxton. Do you want to make her mad? I sure don't. The School of Hard Knocks is in session. Pound for pound, one of the strongest superstars in the women's division. And representing the Creed Brothers from Knoxville, Tennessee, Ivy Nile. You know, Ivy Nile is not the biggest woman around, but Nile has honed her body into a finely tuned weapon. As tenacious and vicious as they come. Yeah, Ivy Nile's bite is much worse than her bark. Yeah, but her teeth are sharpened and she's looking for a win. This may be cliche, but Ivy Nile proves it's not the size of the dog in the fight, but the fight in the dog. Here we go, folks. The last woman standing match is all about pushing your limits mentally and physically. I'd take a mental beat down over a physical one any day. I'm used to those. It's like any night working with you, Saxton. Aw, oh, thanks, Corey. I enjoyed the years we spent together, too. Monster set up in the corner. Counters that. Answer after answer for each other's offense here. What are we going to see here? impact that may well be a turning point in this match uh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad come on this isn't right now looking for something to waylay her opponent with once she gets going with that kendo stick this match could be over real fast oh my goodness Ooh. ivy nile has to avoid that kind of offense if she wants to be in this match Oh, I think we're gonna see it. Here it comes. X 
suplex. Man! A steady stream of moves taking out Nile. Ivy has to find a way to turn things around. A counter by Nile. Yeah, but she needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. Bang! Foot to the midsection. Oh, attacked in the midsection. on Nile. Here's a snapmare. And a basement drop kick. And a chill comes over the arena as she channels forces beyond our understanding. Uh, anyone got the number for a priest? Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Oh man, the referee just counted to seven. And she's able to get to her feet. You have to admire her perseverance. Going forward. And she gets herself out of a precarious position. She flips it back on her. She's lost some of that energy she had earlier. And we're deep into this last man standing match now. Every blow makes it harder and harder to stay off the ground. It looks like she's got a few more ideas before we call it a day on this one. Tight spot for Ivy here. Nile's on her last breath. She's got the whole WWE Universe rallying behind her. And there's seven. This is not good. Not over yet. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Oh, arm drag. And that's another focused attack to her torso area. Ivy is losing grip of this match now. Ivy's got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. Good buster! Oh, my God. Oh, come on, really? It looks like they're not done inflicting punishment. Referee has to break the 10 count now. Twist of fate! Up to the top rope now. She clearly has a plan in mind, Cole. Feeling the WWE Universe on another level. This is her fuel. She's looking highly motivated, getting hyped up. Oh, wow. Rendered unconscious. The official has to call it. Here is your winner, the captain. Ivy Nile suffering a loss here. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation. I've seen my share of brutality during my time in the square circle, but you take it to a whole new level. <laughs> Impressive stuff. But a little wisdom from an old-timer. People will start to see you as the one to take out to prove themselves. If you want to send a message, 
take out a newbie in the PC. Baseball bats, no DQ, really lay it on. Trust me, everyone will think twice before stepping up to you.